This is Marcus, a student who suddenly realizes that he has got no plans for the evening. In order to make a decision and to arrange with his friends, Marcus creates a poll on his mobile device Poll2Go. He uses back of device interaction, so he is not affected by the fat finger problem. From the main menu, he chooses to create a new poll. As he wants his friends to give only one answer, he selects single choice question. The device uses a quick write editor to easily enter question and answers. Having created a question, Marcus wants to add an answer that can be selected by the participants. After three more answers, Marcus navigates to the address book and drags all desired recipients to the drop here zone. To send the poll, the next button is pressed. As Marcus himself is participating the poll, he is asked to give his vote. Mark, who is riding the train, gets notified about the poll. He shall give an answer. Mark can see the progress of the decision process. Two out of three participants already voted. Finally, David receives the poll. David likes to see the intermediate result before he votes. He finds out that there's a tie between disco and cinema at the moment. He explores Mark voted for cinema and Marcus voted for disco. Having a precise overview about the process, David determines the poll. The process is completed and the final results are displayed. The guys will meet at the cinema. With the help of our device, the three guys could quickly agree on an evening activity, without having to coordinate the process by redundant communication as they would for example be using the telephone. So there is more time for the really important things in life.